welcome back to my channel at home with shell so today's video is a huge autumn home decor haul i'm so excited to film this video i've literally bought so many things from lots of different shops i've got things from amazon ebay poundland home bargains local garden centers lots and lots of things to show you nice about getting in cozy jumpers sitting inside getting the blankets out all the lovely decor I love all the colors of the autumn so yeah I'm really excited to film this video and then in next week's video I'll be doing a decorate with me video where I'll be showing you how I've basically kind of styled everything up that I've bought today and how I've added a little bit of autumn decor into my house if you are new to my channel then hi my name's Michelle, I upload videos every single week on things like cleaning, cooking, interiors, hauls, a little bit of everything really. So if that's the kind of thing that you like then I would love to have you subscribe to my channel. I also post quite a lot of home and kind of cleaning bits on my Instagram page which is at home with Shell, and I'll link that down below for you if you want to give me a follow over there too. So let's get into today's haul. So I basically thought I would kind of do it shop at a time just to have some kind of structure to the video. So I'll start off by showing you the things that I picked up from Amazon. So this is one of my favourite pieces and I'm very impressed with the quality. Um, I wanted a leaf garland for quite a while and some of them come up so expensive. So I was really impressed with this one. This one is actually six foot long and you can see it here. I will kind of do another shot of it so you can see it in full but yeah it's really nice i love the colors on it so you can see all the colors on it here it's really bendy so you can kind of bend the leaves to how you want it how you want to style it up and um, what i also like about it is that at the end it comes with these kind of hooks there as well and it did actually come with two hooks so you can hang it up like a wreath so over not like a wreath like a garland so you can hang it over a fireplace what i think i'm going to do with it is put it over the radiator cover in my hallway and create like a little autumnal display on there i think that will look really nice just with this some candles and some pumpkins i think yeah that will look really cool so i got this from amazon and this was eight pound which yeah i think is quite good and it came on it was on prime delivery as well so it came the next day the next thing that I got from Amazon are these pumpkins. I actually bought these last year, but they are still in stock this year. I love these because they really go well with my home decor. So there's a pack of six in here and there's pumpkins that look like this. They're kind of, they're not polystyrene. I'm not really sure what the material it is, but I really like them. Um, and again, I think they will look beautifully styled up either on the table or I might style these with the garland over my radiator cover in the hallway to create a really nice display when you come in through the door so yeah these are really nice and if like me you're not a massive fan of all the orange some rooms it will look okay in but others like my living room is kind of like gray and white so it doesn't really the oranges doesn't really go in there um so i think these will look really cool and there's loads of different sizes in here as well so yeah you get six so i think these with other pumpkins will look really cool. These were again £8 from Amazon. Next up I'll show you what I picked up from eBay. eBay have some fantastic things on there and they're really reasonably priced as well. Um, I was looking for some cushion covers. I honestly looked everywhere and they were all coming up like there was quite a few on Etsy that I found that were really nice um, but they were all around kind of £12 and I kind of didn't really want to pay that much for a cushion cover that I'm probably only going to have in the house for a month or so. So I've seen these on eBay and I was really impressed. I picked up a couple and um, they did kind of do like different patterns and things. So this is the first one. So I think it's about 50, no, what is it? I can't remember how wide it was. It was about 48. I'll have a look and link it down below for you. Um, I really like these. They're a really nice kind of fabric material and they're actually really good quality. I'm very impressed with the quality. Um, and what I really like about these is they match perfectly with my sofa in the kitchen, which is where I'm planning on putting them. Um, so yeah, I got this one with the kind of the, the tree and the bike on there. And then I also picked up another one, very similar. So again, with the, the tree and the bike and the autumn colours, which I absolutely love. 
and these were only four pounds including delivery which i think is just amazing and honestly they are such good quality so i'm just going to put these over some existing cushions that i've already got in my kitchen just to add a, a bit of an autumnal feel in there the next thing that i picked up from ebay is this autumnal kind of decoration pack in here there's various different shapes of like pumpkins and kind of squash fake fruits i suppose um, there's also some miniature acorns in here a couple of pine cones there's some leaves in here um, so what i'm planning on doing with this is just kind of scattering it around on a tray that i've got in my kitchen um, and yeah creating a, a bit of a display um, so these were from ebay and these were £4.50 which again i think is really reasonable because on amazon these were around £10 so yeah make sure you check on ebay for anything that you're looking to buy the next thing I picked up from eBay are these lights. So these are a pack of 10 lights. They're battery operated lights. I'll just turn them on for you so you can see. So hopefully you can see that. Um, they've basically just got a little light under each leaf. Um, and again, I think I'll probably style these up either in the hallway somewhere, on the table, maybe in the kitchen, um, and just create a, a bit of a an autumn display and I think they will look really cool especially at night when it's all lit up it will look so cozy and nice and these were five pound for the battery operated lights from eBay I also picked up a couple of pieces in Asda um, Asda have some really nice home pieces in there um, and I've seen this cushion in there which I really liked so this was seven pound I really liked it because I thought it was really subtle I liked the shape of it um, and yeah, so this is the cushion cover and the cushion for £7, which I think is really reasonable. Just says cosy. So again, this will sit on my sofa in the kitchen with the other two cushions beside it. And I just think that will just give it a really nice autumnal feel. So yeah, £7 from Asda. Um, I also picked up a couple of candles in Asda. So these are just plain, um, these are just plain kind of cream white candles. So these will just kind of form part of one of the displays. I haven't quite decided how I'm going to use them. And these were only a pound each, which, bargain. I picked up some um, pot puree in Wilkinson's. So I just got this because I really liked the colours of it. So the creams and the browns. And I thought this would look really cool. I haven't quite decided what I'm going to do, but maybe in with these candles, like in a either in a candle holder or a large vase, one of these candles in it, and then basically put the pot pourer around it. And I thought then with maybe some of the the other bits that I've got, that would create a really nice kind of centerpiece on the table. So yeah, and plus it will smell really nice. And this was three pounds for a Wilkinson's. The next couple of bits I'll show you are what I picked up from a local garden centre. So there's a garden centre called Gates in um, Oakham in Leicestershire area. So if you're from the Leicestershire, Northamptonshire, Lincolnshire area, it's definitely worth visiting. It's honestly one of my favourite garden centres to go to. Um, and I know it's early, but at the end of September, they got their Christmas decorations out. Honestly, it is absolutely fantastic in there. So I had a look in there and picked up a couple of bits. Um, so the first thing I picked up are these scented pine cones. Um, these were in the Christmas section, um, but I thought with the, the colours and everything, they would go really nice for my autumn decor as well. And they smell incredible. So they would take me through from autumn to Christmas. So I got these. Um, I think these were, how much were these? £6, which I think for a massive pack of pine cones is really good. And then with that, I just picked up some, um, it can either be used as pine refresher or the pot pour refresher oil in winter spice. And so that was only two pounds. So I'll use that probably in winter again. And then the next thing I picked up are these candles. So I really like these. These are just the LED candles. Um, I've got a set of three here. They had them in cream and gray. I decided to go for the gray ones because I thought they'd look really nice in my living room. Um, and what I like about these is they're actually really good quality. Um, I'll just get one out to show you quickly. So they're like this and they're glass and a lot of ones that you pick up like this are plastic um, but yeah these are glass and these were 14 
Next up, I'll show you what I picked up in Poundland. Um, they didn't have that much when I went in there. Um, it was more kind of Halloween stuff as opposed to autumn decor stuff. But I'll show you what I picked up. So I picked up these really cute little pumpkins. So these are light up pumpkins. And I thought for a pound, they're quite good. Um, so I picked up one in this black glittery colour and one in like a silver glitter. And I'll probably just put them in my living room because they'll go with the... The decor in there um then i also got so i'm planning on doing a, a kind of a, a diy pumpkin so i've bought these um you know the donut hair things that you can get so i've bought these and then what i'm thinking of doing is getting some material i've actually got some in the garage or an old jumper or something um wrapping it round here and then turning this into like a little pumpkin I thought that would look really cool and then just kind of stick in a, a stick in the top so i brought a couple of them and then i also picked up some wool in there because i thought round the edges you know how pumpkins kind of have the the ridges in them oh i've pulled that somehow oops so you know how pumpkins have the the ridges in them around the edge i'm thinking once i've put the material around here and then i will use the wool to kind of create the ridges in the pumpkin i'm not the best at doing diy so we'll <laughs> we'll see how it turns out um but yeah i mean they were a pound so i haven't really lost anything and hopefully they'll look quite cool so i'll be showing you how to do that in next week's video and then i just picked up um a couple of other bits in poundland so just some spider webs um window silhouettes so this is more for halloween itself as opposed to autumn decor and then just picked up this glow-in-the-dark skeleton as well because it was only a pound and I thought that's quite cool so we'll just decorate the house a little bit for Halloween. So that is everything that I picked up from Poundland and then I've also got a massive bag that I picked up from Home Bargains. Home Bargains actually had quite a few autumn bits in there and they were really reasonably priced so I'll show you what I picked up. Um, again I picked up some glittery pumpkins and oh my god the glitter has got absolutely everywhere it was a nightmare when I was putting them through the checkout it just went everywhere it was really embarrassing um and now it's all over the bag so anything else I bought a few um cleaning products when I was in home bargains as well so I literally when I got home had to wash everything because it was just all covered in glitter which was <laughs> yeah a bit annoying um so I picked up a couple of these pumpkins I really like these these were only 99p which I thought was really good. So I bought a, a black glittery one. Actually, I've got two black glittery ones and a silver glittery one. I'm honestly getting covered in glitter, <laughs> um, which I quite like. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep them this colour. Um, if they go in my living room, I'll keep them like this. But if I put them elsewhere, I might spray paint them white. Um, yeah, because I think actually spray painting them white would look pretty cool. And they're quite big ones as well. Um, and then I also got this massive pumpkin here. So this was really good value. This was actually only £3.99, which I thought for a massive pumpkin like this was really good. And it's got a light in it, so you can turn on the light here. Um, I don't like the colour of it. I think it actually looks really tacky. So what I'm going to do is spray paint this one white as well. And I thought this will make a really nice centrepiece, maybe on the dining room table with some of these smaller pumpkins, the white ones that I showed you from Amazon earlier. Some of them kind of decorated around that, maybe with some leaves or something around. I think that would make, yeah, a really nice centerpiece because I want to really do like a centerpiece. I do, I always do one for Christmas on the dining room table. So I thought it would be really nice to do one for autumn. And I think that spray painted white, obviously when I've got all the glitter off it as well. Um, yeah, will actually look really nice. And then I've got a couple of other kind of autumn bits in there so picked up this um gingerbread candle i mean look at that look it's literally covered in glitter so this candle was only 79p so yeah i think that will hopefully i mean it smells nice in here so hopefully when you light it that will smell nice as well um i really love it cleaning in the autumn when you kind of light your autumn candles and things it's just i don't know just creates that real cozy feeling as well doesn't it and then the other thing that I picked up in here is just this mug, which was only 79p, which, yeah, I think is amazing. So hot chocolate weather, and just to sit here and just watch some films, get the blankets on, have a nice hot chocolate with 
loads of cream and marshmallows on it. I just think, yeah, proper autumn vibes going on here. So yeah, and 79p, I thought it was a real bargain. So that is everything that I've picked up. Um, I really hope that you've enjoyed this decor haul. And like I said earlier, in next week's video, I'll actually be showing you how I decorate the house for autumn. Um, I've also got some plants that I picked up. So I'm going to change some of these summer plants for winter plants outside. Um, yeah, and just kind of create a bit of a an autumnal feel in the house. So I really hope that you've enjoyed this video and it gave you some ideas on the type of all terminal decor that's out there, how much things are, some of the things that you can get. If you have enjoyed this video, then please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, then I would love for you to subscribe. And yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.